After a very exciting set between XYK and Ragu, down to last stock, last hit, we're going to see Ragu and Gemini. I don't know if these two have played in the past, are you are you? Yeah, aware? They, they play at Arcade Legacy. Okay. Um, How has it normally gone in the past? Ragu has won in the past, I, th I don't think Joe's beat him, but um, Joe's been grinding against Sheik, he's trying to figure out the matchup. Yeah. He's been um, doing better and better. You know what's funny is, uh, Gemini and I, we both went, Gemini and I is weird. Yeah, okay, but, at a suite. Yeah, yeah, we went to this. suite. Okay, so we both got eliminated. We both got 25th out of like 250 entrants. And we both got eliminated by the two same Sheik players in a different order. Paper and show, right? Uh, no, no, no. Um, yeah, yeah, Paper and show, And they're both definitely fantastic players. Yeah, Paper but, um, was the second seed in, in uh, Joe and I's pool. Yeah. Yeah, so um, he and I both have decided that we need to grind this matchup out a bit, but... I've heard I've heard top players say that Sheik actually wins. I don't know about that, but I think she yeah. definitely does better against Falco than Fox. It's her preferable space really? matchup. You think? I think so. I think some people think that Fox destroys Falco. It really just depends on who you talk. I know Sheik. Like Sheik does better against Falco than she does against Fox. Oh, I could see that because yeah. at least Fox can recover, and Fox has more bread and butter combos with like yeah. the wave dashing or wave shining also, across the stage. I just I think Sheik covers side B options better than up B options. I think Fox's upbeat gives him a lot against Sheik, rather like as opposed to like Marth. Yeah. And uh, you know the needles are so good at stuffing the side B's. Oh, um, hate to see that. Ford tilt is huge. Great for intercepting the side B. She she handles side B very well, and that's Falco's better recovery tool. All that being said, we we spoke about this in the last set. Um, Ragu describes FD as a stage he feels very comfortable on, so um, maybe Gemini's just not aware of that, or maybe he also feels comfortable here. I'm just, I, I don't know. What do you think about this pick in the matchup? I don't. Oh, I don't think it's a, a good stage for Sheik. Traditionally. Yeah, traditionally, yeah, but you know, personal preference right. trumps those kinds of things, in my opinion. And uh, I, I think Joe's thinking, well, I'll just laser. Yeah, yeah. The thing is, that's what I thought too when I took uh, Ragu here once. And it just Ragu, doesn't work out. He's, he's just good at it. It's very weird. The thing is, I think Ragu is a player that's really good at picking up on tendencies and adapting yeah. to the play style of the opponent. And um, because of that, he can tell when you know when you're going to laser, when you have those yeah. laser habits. He and has, he's going to come in with a dash attack. He has good intuition about grab Damn. here, oh dash attack God. here. Oh, good combo. Free yeah. Attack game one. Yeah, we'll go ahead and highlight that. Nice. Proud of you. <laughs> Ragu with a, a mild vocal pop off. He pat himself on the uh, metaphoric back. His face remains expressionless, but. As it always does. There, there's a smile. Okay, so Gemini taking him to Dreamland. Um, I, I think Joe just likes the platforms of this stage. He likes the way they. I could see it. I don't think Joe and I have ever played on this stage. Just literally pass all the area. And you'll do whatever you want. Joe's movement is looking fine right now. He's uh yeah we uh we've been practicing perfect wave dashes. Oh yeah, something we've been grinding in the, in the Dayton Smash Fest. Very important. And he's not dead. There we Falco go. Falco gets a lot from it too. Oh, there we go. Edge cancel. Bear. West balls. Very quick. That was a, like he must have gotten that bear out like the first possible frame. Oh, I, and why not? Great out of shield option. Oh, Power he misses the tech. That could have been big to reestablish stage position. Just yeah. doing a lot of wave dashes back. So Thanks. notice there, um, Ragu had stage position, and um, Gemini jumps in with a very committal full drift towards Gemini uh, approach. A lot of um, pros in this matchup will say, you know, you're just supposed to laser Sheik and force her to approach you. Yeah. Not necessarily, um, you know, approach her, unless you really have a read that she's going to jump out of shield. Yeah, and it really feels like Gemini is going straight in. He I think to laser a bit more and, and force yeah. Ragu to want to come to him, I think. Yeah, it's tough because at this percent with these stocks, Ragu might just sit there and get hit with lasers. He's already yeah, he's already at one. Like you know, it doesn't even matter at this point. Like one back air is gonna do it no matter where yeah. they are. On the as stage. soon as Joe can take the stocks, though, I would agree that he needs to um, be a little more disciplined in neutral with his lasers. He doesn't want to go right on the ledge like that. And unfortunately, um, short hop back is not a quick enough. Oh, there he goes. Grabs the ledge. Shine nice grab, walking good. shine grab. Ah, uh, uh, yeah. He's getting too antsy. He can't. Um, yeah. yeah, he jumps. You just you yeah. can't challenge Sheik when she's on the edge. Yeah, he's. he's Hi, Gemini. Could have down smash there too. Nice needles. Whoa, that was really fast, Jack. Yeah. Oh, up tilts him. 
Okay. Don't be up so Oh, and look at those multi shines. Good, good call on the third. Oh yeah, Joe always Jerry, here. Pop up multi shines. Could that be how it starts? What? Could that be how oh, the, the comeback? comeback starts? Each he's he's There's gonna a take a stack, and each stack is gonna get a little bit more multi shines in. Yeah, he's gonna keep powering up. And finally, stock oh, three, ten multi shine, thirty one times in a row. What do you think about Ragu going for up air there instead of forward air? I think forward air would have set for a pretty free edge guard. Yeah, I am. Um, set. May have just been a mistake. Is that the mistake that we need? Because I think forward air is definitely shield? the option there. Oh. Yeah. I think that's gonna do it. Joe did a good job wave dashing back to continue the pressure after the roll, but uh, didn't wasn't quite fast enough to actually get a punish off of it. Well, good I games. Think, um, you know, I think we all have a long way to go. But luckily that was recorded and Joe's there. Yeah, I gotta, yeah, I could definitely go back. Are you yeah, patient well, and really game just three, you make my spots better? You like, stop yeah. being patient. Uh, oh, Raju yeah. wants you to walk up to his Shino stall. He's love that. And yeah, he likes that. And at the higher percent, I get so frustrated when it, it's like, yeah. I'm like, yeah. Because like, well, you're not good at approach to the